hello everybody and welcome back to another tutorial in this video you will learn how to create a discord bot very easily within a few clicks so the websites you will be needing for this tutorial is this discord developer portal and this bot ghost so these two websites are the ones we will be using to basically create this bot and then you'll also need a discord server so that you can run and check if your bot is working correctly so we'll come back to this later because at first what i want to do is head over to discord developer portal and then create a new application using this new application button and then i'll name my application i'll just name it squidbot and then i'll agree to the terms and services and then click on create once i'm done with this I will be heading over to bot ghost and then click on create a server it should take a minute to load and then you will see this authorized thing which basically will want your which bot ghost basically wants access to your account it's completely safe to give so you have nothing to worry about once you click on that in this in this step you'll see that it's asking for something called bot token and the way you get your bot token is by going over to the discord developer portal and heading over to this bot tab once you click on reset token and click on yes do it you will see your bot token so copy it and then paste it over here and make sure to not reveal this discord's token bot token to someone else because whoever has access to this token can control your discord bot so be safe and don't share it with anyone but giving it to bot ghost won't really do anything because it's just a website that's helping you to create the bot so that's completely safe and with this now what you want to do is invite the bot to your discord server and the way you do that is heading over to this invite tab basically click on it and then select the server I'll select tutorial server hit server hit continue and hit author authorize I'll finish this capture there it is once you see this screen you can close this so I'll do that and once you are done you will see that your discord bot is on your server and the way you know that it's working is that bot coast this website will send a message automatically over here you can of course delete this no worries so now I will enable a few commands the way you do that is by going over to bot coast and then scrolling down a little bit and then you see these all of these commands such as auto react verification mod mail auto mail auto mod and if you go down even more you'll see a lot more commands and everything so for me for now I'll just select one of these let's see which one we can set up um, actually let's go ahead and do the moderation one I'll click on moderation and then once you go in moderation you'll see that it has a lot of commands such as ban and mute warning status and everything I don't really need all of these so I'll just check them off I just need uh, these few commands once I'm done with everything I will click on save changes and it's basically done this bot will be 24 7 online and you can use this so let's test it out I think this had a ping command gets the ping of the server and gets the ping of the server and the bot so yeah we can use this to check if everything is working I'll click on ping by using a slash command getting ping pong latency is, latency is 277 milliseconds and yeah so basically it's working and the kick and ban command should also work alongside so 
I will test that out by adding an, another bot in my server. So I added Carl bot to test out the kick command. So let's just do this slash kick and then using our discord bot this is the one because I don't have a profile picture set this is why it's showing like this once I click on it and I want click on call bot it might ask you to give out a reason for me I just don't want to put any reason once I hit enter there it is call bot is gone and squid bot the bot we created has kicked it so basically this means that it is working and yeah you can basically even ban it and do kick commands and do whatever you want with it and that is it that's basically how you easily make a discord bot and thank you for watching i will be taking my leave now be sure to subscribe and make sure to turn on the bell notifications and share this tutorial with your friends and go ahead yeah make a discord bot Good luck everyone and take care.